Here at Amplitude, we know our platform is most valuable when teams collaborate and the whole team can benefit from insights created in the product. Dashboards do exactly that, allowing you to collect and share related charts and cohorts in a single convenient view. Dashboard templates take dashboards one step further, allowing you to designate a dashboard you have created as a template for your teammates to use. For example, let's say you create a dashboard which tracks marketing campaign metrics that you know would be useful for future marketing campaigns. Or maybe you create a dashboard which tracks metrics related to an A-B test, which could be used for future A-B tests. In either case, Amplitude makes it easy to templatize your existing dashboards, saving you time and allowing you to be consistent with what metrics you track and how. Let's look at how to create a dashboard template. Here, I have an A-B test dashboard for a fictional company called Amplistore. The dashboard is looking at an A-B test focused on purchases. It looks like a regular dashboard because it is. This is part of what makes dashboard templates so easy to use. You can turn any dashboard into a template and it'll function like a dashboard object in Amplitude which means that it'll be visible in search and can be added to spaces. To make this dashboard a template, I'll click Tag as Template. This gives me the opportunity to provide instructions for using the template. You can include directions for what replacements to make, a description of when to utilize this particular template, or anything else that would help your team. You can see this dashboard is now marked as a template, and the call to action in the top right has changed. The instructions you entered are also visible at the top, right above the parameters to configure. This is where you can set up any replacements your team will need to make in order to make the template usable. For example, in this case, I'll want to set up a replacement for the A-B test so that a different test can be selected. In this example, the property value will be replaced with an onboarding A-B test, but I can make a note in the instructions to replace it with whatever A-B test you want to analyze. You can see how many charts are affected by this replacement here. Make sure you save those parameters, they won't save automatically. Now, when your team uses this dashboard, they will follow your instructions and make the appropriate replacements and add any relevant filters. They can then click here to create a dashboard from this template, retaining all of those replacements and filters. Or if they just want to view the charts with the replacements and filters added without creating a new dashboard, they can do that too. We hope dashboard templates will save you time and streamline your collaboration.